Okay. These are pot stickers, and we do it with a, a, a lattice skirt. And I think doing them with a lattice skirt is just a lot of fun. Um, so I like to put an odd number in there. And the lattice is made up of cornstarch and water. And it's just a more interesting way, I think, to do really a fancy. pot sticker. Yeah. Well, it, you know, and kind of elevates it a bit. Yet so easy. So this is pork. You can use chicken. You can use shrimp. You can use a combination of all kinds of things. You can use all vegetables. But if you use all vegetables, by all means, make sure that they're cooked and there's no like spiky pieces of gotcha, carrot gotcha. to pierce the uh, dumpling skin. So I've got some Napa cabbage. I have a healthy amount of Chinese chives, also known as garlic chives. So sesame oil, you hit that with? Yep, I put a little <laughs> Shaoxing, little rice wine, Shaoxing. little sesame oil mm -hmm. for flavor. You can and use soy. sake, you can use mirin, you can use anything, you can you could delete it, you can use bourbon. Um, just don't use something really, really sort of off-putting flavor-wise, like Campari in there <laughs> on its own. We take our dumpling skins. The only mistake that you can make with a dumpling of any kind, whether it's tortellini and in Italy or this right. dumpling in Chinese cooking or a gyoza is to overfill it. And just wet your fingers. The most crucial thing is pinch at the top, move your finger around to occlude all the air and seal the dumpling, and then go the other way. That way, if anything sneaks out, at least you have all the air done. And there all you, you gotta go. do is pleat just crimp it a little that bit. like a little rooster tail. Cute! And stick it so cute. on your board. These are browned enough. I'm just gonna hit them with a little bit of water and let cook those cook through. while we're Steam talking. Yep. These dumplings, by the way, once they get brown. Then you're gonna make your lattice work? Well, yeah, this is three tablespoons of cornstarch with one cup of water. And you just squirt a little bit of that in. Stick a lid on it for about 30 seconds to cook the top right, like right, you're right. basting an egg. That cornstarch has created that beautiful, stunning lattice work on them. Professionals know how to do it one way. All you gotta do is... Hey, look at that.